Hello everyone, Julia here, hello from Sweden and welcome to a new episode of Journal with me. Today I want to work with these pages and I want to use these beautiful animals. Uh, uh, these are from from a brand called uh, Studio Light. I didn't find a name of collection. Uh, these were just few uh, random papers with uh, different things to cut out, like these animals and also cards with these animals. But I will leave uh, links uh, in the description box where I bought this and uh, maybe that will help you to find this as well, If in case if you are interested. I already cut out everything. Uh, so now I just want to choose a few of these beautiful animals and create something here. First thing that I want to do is to use these two collages that I made earlier. Uh, in this little notebook. Uh, this is my notebook for small quick collages sometimes when I don't have enough time for creating uh, something big. I uh, take this notebook and just make a collage. Usually it takes something like 15-20 uh, minutes, maybe half an hour. And that's always very relaxing for me. So I really like this little notebook and uh, then I also like to use these collages in my other projects, like to scan them and uh, use somewhere else. And uh, also for me, it's a great way to use uh, those small paper scraps that are left from other projects uh, because they are really perfect for backgrounds for these little collages. Uh, so I already scanned those few pages and printed them and I just want to have them also here in this journal, so I just will glue them down uh, one here and one on another page and uh, those two other pages I want to use for writing. I want to write some nature related quotes there, so I just will leave them. On the moment and first I will glue down this uh, two collages. Uh, okay, now I want to choose a few elements for uh, these two pages. I want to write there some quotes but I also want to add few small elements there a few of those cute animals. also want to add something to uh, one of these pages in the middle.
And now I'm going to make something here on those two pages. Uh, I think I want to have there two cards also with some quotes. So now I just also use few of these cute animals to make a text box for cards. Now my pages are ready. I chose the cards where I also want to write quotes. So now I just have to find some beautiful quotes. And these pages are ready now. I found really nice quotes for all these pages. So I wrote, uh, I wrote uh, a quote on each of those cards on the back of it. Like this one with a bear and another one as well. And also some bigger quotes on these pages in the middle. And now it's ready. I really like how it's turned out. I love th those cards and these cute animals. I really like that they are kind of wintry, have that wintry vibe, but also there are flowers, so they also have already a bit of a spring vibe and looks really, really cool. And now I want to create another page or maybe even two pages uh, right here. Here I have this cute hedgehog card, which I also want to use somewhere. And uh, for my next page, I want to use this calendar. This, this is a calendar from 2020. From, uh, I ordered this uh, from an Instagram page called Mr. Pocky, I think. Um, probably some of you know this page and this cute little hedgehog. Those pictures always make me smile. Uh, and last year I had a calendar. Uh, which I ordered there and for this year, for 2021, I also already have a new calendar. But the calendar from 2020 I want to recycle and I already made a few envelopes using, using these uh, photos. Um, and I also want to have a few in my journal because they are really very, very cute. And um, for example, this one. I will want to he have here. I think it's kind of a uh, wintry hedgehog cuddling under the blanket. It's really cute. So I will make uh, very simple uh, collages. Cut those pages a bit that they will 
uh, fit here and we'll add a few uh, tiny details around that it looks more or less like like a collage but something very very simple and quick i just want to have these cute pictures in my journal Okay, one page is ready and I think now I have to find um, another page for this cute hedgehog card. I just want to add something small here in this corner because it looks a bit empty and then I will search for a for page where I can put this card. Hedgehog and hedgehog and cat page will be something similar like the one before something very simple I just will cut it a bit and will add a few small details So now all my pages are ready. I really like to have these cute photos in my journal. I like how it turned out. Very simple, but, but it's really cute. And that was all for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!